When you go up in the air, everything that you learned on the ground comes together in the air, and so you really have to know it inside and out. Our pilots are definitely some of the best trained pilots in the, in the world because of the flight training that we go through. So when you show up uh, to flight school in the Navy, uh, they give you um, an ATOPS pub, and it's about this thick, and it has all your systems, um, emergency procedures, any other kind of amplifying information that you need to go fly the particular aircraft that we're going to go fly. You can't just memorize the maneuvers. You have to actually chair fly the maneuvers. You have to uh, make sure you understand what you're doing, because when you get in the cockpit and you get ready to take off, there's about 50 other things going on in that cockpit. You're looking for any kind of um, emergency that you may have on the ground that won't allow you to take off. You might be talking to tower or ground, and so there's radio calls going on. Your instructor might be telling you something. Um, then you have just flying and the noises, the smells of being in the aircraft. If you just memorize it, you're going to get in the cockpit and you're going to forget. When you're on the ground, um, you chair fly, um, you practice taxiing, you ta practice your radio calls, you practice the maneuvers you're going to take for takeoff. Um, what are you going to do once you get in the air? You're always thinking one step ahead of what the aircraft is doing. As a student, you're really kind of learning to put all these things, external things, together so that you can fly. What, you, um, what you're doing, what you're saying, what you should be looking for. The better you know the aircraft, um, the better you know the maneuvers. When you get into the cockpit, um, the better your performance will be.